Now we have four colors: orange, lemon yellow, white, and ultramarine blue. First, we are taking this orange color. We are putting small amount of orange color to the palette, and now ultramarine blue color. After that, we will put some lemon yellow color here, and then we will mix some white color in all three colors, and we'll mix. put the colors together now with a clean brush we will mix lemon yellow plus white and then blue plus white so it will be light blue color please make sure to clean the brushes after every process i'm using five number brush and light blue color so we need to apply the color here with five number brush flat brush we will apply the color like this please be quick because these are acrylic paints and uh, acrylic colors get dry very quickly so now we need to paint it with light blue after that we will apply light orange color the mixture of orange and white here i'm applying the color with the same brush obviously we need to clean the brush with water after applying blue color now we need to blend both the colors together we need to blend it like this simply like this just blend it blend 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 it nicely Please be quick. Once it will get dry, you won't be able to blend it properly. Again, we need to apply the same mixture here with the same brush. That's how we do the blending, and blending is very important in every painting. So please practice the blending part as much as you can. Now. We need to take the mixture of lemon yellow and white. I'm applying lemon yellow and white here with a clean brush and now we need to blend both the colors together like orange and lemon yellow. Both the colors together. See this beautiful shade of sky. Again I'm applying this mixture lemon yellow and white. Again we need to apply the same color here and we will properly blend it. Blend until it looks like this. blending is the most important part and that's how you need to blend it now we will make a line with the mixture of orange and white like this the mixture color here and then again we will apply on top of this and then we will again blend it with lemon yellow color here like this simply hold the brush like this that's how you need to hold the hold the brush that's and we are done with the sky see how beautiful it's looking now we will apply light blue color with the same brush with a clean brush and then apply the same light blue color here on the bottom part like this apply apply here that's how we need to just make a line here and cover the entire remaining part we need to leave that space on the left side for the seashore and that's how we need to cover the entire part with blue color now we will apply the same mixture of orange and white in the remaining part simply like this hold the brush very lightly please make sure to clean the brushes in between the process with water and with a rough cloth and now we need to apply yellow color on top of this orange color now we will take this brown color this is a uh, now this is burnt sienna color and if you don't have the exact shade you can use any light brown or dark brown color and mix some white color to the light brown color in equal quantity and just mix it use three number brush to make the clouds now we will make the clouds make some curves like this simply like this with three number brush and blend the bottom part of the cloud like this hold the brush very lightly and blend it simply like this I just make some curves on top of the cloud and blend the bottom part simply like this if you're not able to blend it with dry brush you can also use damp brush if your colors are getting dry you can just add one two drops of water to the colors don't add more than that please don't add more than that now again we will paint another cloud 
with the same technique here like this yeah exactly like this and we'll make some lines some small clouds here with the same technique if you're not able to do it with on the final piece you can uh, practice it on a rough paper or something and then you can do it on a final painting again we will make some clouds that's how we need to blend it from the bottom part now again make some more clouds here with the same color blend the bottom part Sim simply like this with a dry brush simply like this that's how we need to blend it again we will make some curves small curves see that's how we need to make the clouds some curves will be smaller some will be bigger and make the bottom part appear like this make some make some lines here like this make some lines some clouds some more clouds here apply some brown color here on the seashore and blend blend it now we will take some lemon yellow color we will apply uh, the mixture of lemon yellow and white in middle of the ocean like this see that's how we need to hold the brush to give the textures simply like this hold the brush like this make some fine lines which will look like this blend 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 make it smoother with a brush with the help of the brush now i'm taking some white color again the tip of the brush of three number then we'll apply some white color color in middle of the yellow color simply like this see how am i holding the brush that's how we need to hold the brush just hold the brush like this and spread some white color here now take this five number brush again and this light blue color and apply some fine lines we are making waves here with this color so just apply some fine lines like this from the tip of the brush we don't need to use the entire brush just use the tip of the brush and hold the brush very lightly to make fine lines like this please don't use water to the acrylic paints we don't need to use water to the color now we need to take ultramarine blue color and we will take small amount of white color we will make the this color darker than the first light blue color we will make darker one so we will make the darker shade and uh, now we will take this um, this brush five number brush and again we will start painting some waves like this hold the brush very lightly use the tip of the brush sharp tip of the five number brush and just blend the bottom part of the lines see that's how we need to make it just make the waves simply like this with the light hands and the color will be darker than the first one it's a zigzag wave so we need to make the waves like this and that's how we need to give some textures with the same five number brush see if you're not able to do it on final piece you can do it on a rough paper and then you can do it on a painting just make some shades on the right side do the shading with all dark blue color like this and here again you need to apply some dark blue color now we will take some white color and again see i have just filled the tip of the brush I now we need to apply white color with the tip of the brush of five number just make some waves with white color here again simply like this make some fine lines with five number brush if you are not able to do it with five number brush you can do it with two number brush or zero number brush but most preferably use five number brush now make some white line just give some textures tap 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 that's how we need to make a bold wave here yeah that's it just tap 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 with white color and five number brush make some more waves here we are giving just some depth 
the water so we'll give some textures like this fine textures with now on top of this seashore we will apply some white color to give some highlights and depth to the seashore so see that's how we are giving highlights and just give some textures here on the right side simply like this And again, just tap it, tap, tap, tap to give some textures to the bold wave. After that, with the same three number brush, apply some reflection here in the middle of the waves like this and just blend it from the sides simply like this. Now with a clean dry brush, just blend the sun, edges of the sun, simply like this, with a clean dry brush. And that's it, we are done with this beautiful painting. 